What's up guys, Ben here from FLX with another sizing update for the Baby Maker. Uh, we made one previously, but due to some of the questions uh, and back and forth we've had with both you guys at home sending in questions, as well as people coming into Test Ride, I wanted to make another video for the sizing, especially for those of you who are on that you know, 5'7", 5 5'8", 5 5 height, right in between the frame sizes. So this video, I hope, will clarify some things for you. To begin, the last video we made was of Rob, who is actually 5'8", so right on that borderline. Uh, his preference is for the larger 23 inch frame. As you can see from the video we shot, he fits on it well, he can stand over it, and even from some of these stills I'm about to show you right now, you can see that he even has room to adjust that seat even taller, as well as get good leg extension. Not totally locked out, but still straight on that larger frame. Now, with that being said, I wanted to come out and make another update based on some of the questions that I've gotten from you guys. On our last video, we said that if you are 5'8", uh, or right on that borderline to go ahead and get the larger frame size. I want to tell you guys something. Punch in for effect. I'm retracting that statement. And here's why. If you are 5'8", athletic, uh, you know, similar body type to Rob, you will fit on the larger 23 inch frame, no problem. But like I said before, some of those test rides we've given and some of the questions we've asked has made me sort of rethink this. Um, if you are someone who's 5'8 or 5'9 but has hip issues, right? Difficulty mounting the bike, uh, maybe you're arthritic, maybe you're just not as agile as you once were, I would recommend the smaller frame size now. Rob's preference for someone, his body type and the way he likes to ride is for the larger frame, but if you happen to be a little bit older, um, then what I'm gonna do is actually recommend the smaller 19 inch frame, and here is why. On that smaller bike, you're still gonna fit, even at 5'8", five, 5'9", five, you're still gonna be able to ride it, but it's gonna be a lot easier for you to get on and off the bike. In addition to that, you're gonna be able to adjust the seat higher and lower, and if you really need to, you can buy third party stems that both extend and adjust the angle of the handlebars to get more reach that way. So, again guys, if you were someone who is on the fence, uh, maybe has some of these issues at five foot seven, five foot eight, even five nine, I now recommend you go with a smaller frame because you can make that smaller bike a little bit bigger, but if you get the larger frame size, there's not really much you can do to, to cut it down. So. Again, I wanna apologize for any inconvenience this may have caused. Um, keep in mind, when you request a change, I'm gonna be one that processes anyway, so I'm getting what's due. But I just wanted to be as transparent as possible and let you know that if you watched that last video um, and maybe you're not as athletic as Rob or maybe you don't even have the same riding preferences, to go ahead and pick that smaller frame size Again, I'm sorry for the inconvenience there, but if you do need to change or adjust your order, send an email to hello at flx.bike and I can go ahead and get that adjusted for you. Um, I know this may seem uh, a little wishy-washy, but really I want to be as transparent with you guys as I can. That's who I am as a person and that's who we are as a company. So if you're on the border, um, and maybe you have some of those ailments I talked about, go with the smaller frame. You can hit us up at hello at flx.bike to either change your order or if you have more specific questions, um, I'd be happy to listen to your particular scenario and give you a more specific recommendation from there. So again, this is the new sizing update for the Baby Maker. Um, if you have any questions, please reply letting us know. Thank you guys.